KPIXY's Len Ramirez joins us from the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk, where it has partially reopened. Len? That's right. Uh, no crushing crowds out here today, but that could be the case this weekend as uh, this economy around the beaches in uh, Santa Cruz and Monterey counties reopen. It's going to be back to business, but not business as usual. Sweet treats and a day at the beach. Just the ticket for one couple who drove over from Modesto to enjoy a badly needed getaway. But yeah, I think everybody wants to get away. I'm going Even crazy. Even if it's down the street from your house, everyone just wants to get out of the house. But at the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk, it's not a full reopening. Many of the food booths are serving everyone's favorites. Who doesn't love corn dog, cotton candy? All the staples at the boardwalk from a food standpoint will be available this weekend and beyond. But most of the arcade games and all of the rides, including the Giant Dipper, are still in lockdown because of the pandemic. But the main thing we want people to know is that we are taking extraordinary measures to ensure that everyone who visits the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk is safe and healthy. We have uh, procedures and protocols for all of our employees, including wearing masks at all times. Although the beaches are supposed to be open only for people to exercise and remain closed for sunbathers until July, there was practically no enforcement of those rules today. But the biggest changes starting tomorrow have to do with restaurants and hotels. Outdoor dining will be allowed, and hotels like the Chaminade Resort are gearing up to welcome out-of-town guests for the first time since shelter-in-place began in March. We miss you know, our customers, our guests. Um, it's been really quiet around here for you know, three or four months. And we were, couldn't be more excited to see people back here dining and here with us at Chaminade. And we're back here live at the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk. You know, this is one of the few businesses around here that were around during the last pandemic in, uh, you know, 100 years ago, 1918. This started in 1907, so it's seen a lot of ups and downs. They know that this year is probably not going to be a very good year. They're hoping to come back stronger, though, in 2021. Reporting live in Santa Cruz, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.